I did another technical dive together with my dive buddy Mark to what's known as the shallow mesophotic zone. Uh, our dive led us to about 40 to 45 meters in Darwin on Negros Oriental in the Philippines. Interestingly, this area doesn't have any reefs. It's a sandy area which is dominated by Halimeda macroalgae, crinoids, sponges, and cyanobacterial films. This is my little bit of environmentalism for the day. I'm under no illusion that I'm saving the ocean, but it can't hurt to pick up plastic. We didn't see that much plastic. We also saw a fish trap which must have tumbled down from shallow regions. As soon as we ascended above about 20 meters, the fish density vastly increased. This is both due to depth and due to the fact that the reef starts again at about 20 meters in Darwin. Okay, so today's dive was by no means an extreme dive, 45 meters, um, but it was a, a technical dive nevertheless. So we used more equipment than on a, on a typical recreational scuba dive. So what we used is a set of double tanks with a larger wing. And so with these double tanks, we have redundancy in case something uh, goes wrong we have a second tank to get our air from we were still using air this was by no means deep enough that we we have to use uh, helium containing gases um, like trimix and we had one decompression tank that decompression tank contains 50 percent oxygen so this allows us to decompress faster come to the surface faster so 